Another video I'm gonna get shit for by all my women. What about those poor guys that have to stay quiet? Seeing their girls, wives, girlfriends, whatever it is, people that they're dating, show half of their ass on social media because it will be considered toxic to say, hey, I really don't like that you're showing off your body like that on social media. Thank you, my love, for addressing the girls and the wives. I will now do my part and talk to the boyfriends and husbands about why the rap consciousness behavior on social media can lead to a painful end of the relationship. Remember, Mr. Boyfriend, that the next time you take one of those sexy Instagram pics for your lady in your city or on vacation, you are supporting the following sequence of events. With the raise in followers she gets from sexualizing herself, she will get the attention of guys with blue check marks who are more financially successful, have more followers, and are more physically attractive than you. Then, with a new inflated market value sponsored by our dear Simp Nation. What's up, Simp Nation? She will see that she can do way better than you. And as soon as the relationship doesn't feel as high anymore, she leaves you for someone who she kept warm in her DMs. Now, many women will say, no, I would never because I love my picture-taking boyfriend. Remember that women make decisions based on their emotions. Now she might feel happy in the relationship and because of that rationalize to you that you'll be together forever. In that moment she might even believe that herself because again women rationalize based on emotions. The moment her emotions change she will backwards rationalize and say that she was blinded and gaslighted and you a narcissist or any other word she finds to justify her current emotional state. And Mr. Boyfriend, if you still don't believe me, see the comment section down below of all the fallen soldiers who fought alongside a woman who is never really there for them, but the way they made her feel. I don't have a mic, but I need to drop a mic. Obama? Obama. <laughs> Nick Watt, ABC News.